Hello. <laughs> I, uh... One second. Hold on. So, hmm, hmm, I'm messing with uh, audio settings. Uh, OBS has a couple of th things, filters by default, and they mess with the audio, and I didn't like them, so I turned them off, and uh, I'm not sure how it sounds. Hopefully it sounds better. Uh, well, I guess I'll never know until... Uh, I review the VOD afterwards, but yeah, I uh, turned the filters off and it was messing with things. I just made some adjustments just now because uh, I was watching the little sound meter thing and it was doing shit and I was like, yeah, I don't like that. I was just eating some pretzel sticks before stream. I was also having a lens problem. Where uh, there was shit on my lenses and I was trying to get them off. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. 
Now I can see it picking up me crunching on these pretzel sticks, which they're crunchy. Uh, I'm just not sure how well it's picking them up or how loud it's picking them up. Hopefully it's not too obnoxious like ASMR like. Oh yeah, that's good shit right there. Yeah. I don't even know how that sounds. I just don't know. But uh, yeah. Welcome. Happy Tuesday. February 1st. Mm-hmm. Ah, so. Dark Souls Custom News. <clears throat> for those uh, waiting for update. It's almost done. Yeah. So, uh... What was it? Yesterday and today, I didn't get much time to work on it today, but a lot of time yesterday. But I was working on it today. I was working on the Magician class. And it's coming along nicely. I really like how it's uh, turning out. <clears throat> uh, my main issue I'm having... Essentially, the Magician is completely done in terms of concept. I actually need to uh, transfer what I have in concept onto cards and the character board and whatnot. And it's not no problem. The, the difficult thing I'm having, the problem I'm having, is images. Uh, I always have trouble with images because uh, I am not the item like picture designer for Dark Souls. So I can't match that. I'm not an artist, so I still cannot make my own depiction of things. And uh, the best I've done is make like the uh, custom icons for different like cards, enemies, bosses, and classes and shit. Which I'd say the, the icons I made for the Magician and Alchemist look pretty nice. But it's the images for the cards themselves that I'm having issues with. Like, um, one of the cards I'm working on is like the, the swords in a box trick, you know, magicians have. And I cannot find a fucking image for the life of me. It sucks. So I need to figure out what I'm going to do. But, um, after I finish the Magician, all of the, uh, all the major additions to the update, to the mod, through the update, will be finished. The only thing I'll have left to do is make some minor adjustments, add some little small things, like, um... I was gonna add a couple of new dice. And dice aren't that difficult to make. So. Yeah. And, uh. Well, uh. It's not a minor thing, but it's not a major thing. I was gonna make a board for the, uh. The merchant in dungeon mode. There's gonna be a merchant. And I need to make a custom board for them. Which also shouldn't take that long. So I don't classify it as a major edition. But I don't classify it as a minor edition. Because it's kind of in between. It's a medium edition. But um. Other than that. Um. I was going to re like adjust some things that other people made. Someone mentioned uh, at some point a few months back the uh, <clears throat> custom bosses people made are outdated and they have more updated versions on a like uh, a Google Drive or something or a Mega something like that. So I was going to update them to the updated versions. Yeah. 
So <clears throat> after that, I just need to update the book of custom where I update information, add new information, you know, uh, flavor text and whatnot. And then I need to make the thumbnail. <clears throat> and update should be done. I give an estimate it will probably be done like first half of this month probably. And yeah, probably will. Probably will be done first half of this month. You know, I'm not going to have as much time to work on it throughout this week because of stream. Uh, what was it, a couple weeks ago? Or... Was it a couple weeks ago or was it last Tuesday? <clears throat> it was either Thursday a couple weeks ago or it was last Tuesday. Or I took the day off. It might have been Tuesday. It might have been last Tuesday. I took the day off to work on the mod and made a substantial amount of progress. Like, the whole day I worked on the mod. And I believe that's when I finished, um... The Alchemist, I think. Yeah. <clears throat> and... You know, I'm really proud of the work I've done. It's, um... I feel like... The, uh... The Dark Souls, the board game, has been a lucky break for my part. Allowing me to find something that I actually really enjoy doing, like... Um... Just in any way, shape, and form, I guess. Probably not the right words. But, uh, designing a board game, essentially. Uh, I'm not designing the entirety of it, I'm designing aspects of it, but... Uh, with the introduction of dungeon mode and me working on Ark the board game, I found that I kind of really enjoy making board games. And that might be something I want to do later on in life, in the future. Sounds like fun. I love board games. I just wish there was a... Easy way to do things. Like, have you ever tried streaming a board game? I haven't. But it looks like a bitch. The cameras, man. The cameras have got to be the worst part. That and glare. Lights and... Because you need lights to see to get good lighting, but you don't want it to reflect too much off the board. Sucks. <clears throat> but, uh, if you're ever in the neighborhood, uh, I've, I just, you don't have to, but just, uh, I'm asking as a favor. If you like Dark Souls, if you like Dark Souls the board game, if you have Tabletop Simulator, if you don't have Tabletop Simulator, uh, just... Go to the workshop page on Tabletop Simulator for or Dark Souls Custom and just give it a thumbs up or something. <laughs> I sound like a fucking YouTuber. But, <clears throat> salt. Duh. But, uh, you know, I get it. I get it. You know, YouTubers, they come across as annoying, obnoxious. They're like, hey, hit that like button and subscribe. Ring that bell. Uh, most of that is obnoxious and really annoying, but, uh, you know, a lot of people will question, what's the point of the like button? It doesn't even do anything. Uh, mechanically, no, it doesn't do anything, but it does do something. It lets them know you appreciate their work. <laughs> you know, some people, myself included, use, uh, the like button to... Essentially, you mark a video that you're like, oh, this is hilarious. This is great. I love this. Uh, I'll probably watch this later. So you like it, and it goes into your liked videos category. And so you can watch it later. I do that. 
but it's like a video is so good you liked it enough to actually go out of your way to press a button to watch it again later that lets the creator know you actually really enjoy that you like that a lot and i get that after making what like five six tabletop simulator mods i get that now it feels good when people like it But, to me personally, what I enjoy more than just a thumbs up, and a subscribe, and a bell icon. <clears throat> what I enjoy more is the interaction. I like when people give me, like, feedback. Like, real feedback in the form of, Hey, I tried this thing you made. Here's what I think about it. Like... Constructive criticism, they call it. And... I really like that. I like constructive criticism. Because that's something I like to do with games, is I take them apart, I determine what I like about them, and I determine what I hate about them. You know, how game reviews are supposed to be. But... We've fallen from grace, so constructive criticism is scarce, but not, like, impossible to find. If you go to a review page, if you go to a store page of a game on Steam, uh, most of the reviews will just be nonsense, you know, funny jokes, just people saying bad game. But then uh, every now and then you'll find, like, an actual review that breaks it down. And those people I appreciate. So, more important to me... <clears throat> if you're into Dark Souls Custom, Dark Souls the board game, Tabletop Simulator, you know, all that stuff. More important to me than liking the mod, I would like to hear what you think about it. Have interaction. That's one of the reasons I started a Twitch channel is as opposed to a youtube youtube uh i would have a much easier time like cranking out videos you know i could be like oh i'll make like 20 to 30 minute videos just back to back make like three four maybe more videos a day i've like designated like two days of the week to make videos uh it would take effort to edit them and whatnot but um i've done it before and I'm used to it. I know how to do it. It's not the most strenuous, but it is effort. But uh, one of the reasons I started Twitch instead is because I like the the feedback, the live feedback. There's none of that going on right there right now, because starting shit out is hard, difficult. Getting people to you know, stop on by, have a nice chat, but right there, it's, <laughs> but when they do, I appreciate it, especially when, uh, there's like an engaging conversation going on between me and the people right here, and that's what I strive for. I also have, like, other reasons that I won't go too much in depth, but something along the lines of, uh, I like analyzing the behavioral patterns of people, and having conversations with people allows you to really read that. And that's just, uh, an abridged version of one of the reasons, but yeah. Anyway, you're here for that! So let's start that. Let's get to it.
Metroid Prime! 19%! Just under 5 hours of laps. Which is funny, because we've done two streams that are 4 hours each. But, uh, you know, between saves and whatnot. Bendrana Drifts. We got Space Jump, except it's not Space Jump. Ah, the power's out. Yeah, yeah. We got a uh, night thermal, yeah, thermal vision. Let me get back in the zone for this game, how this game works. This reminds me of Betty Bad. Have you guys ever heard of Betty Bad or played Betty Bad? It's a badass game. I think by Wild Tangent from like the early 2000s. Betty Bad's awesome. Uh, I'm going the wrong way. Oh yeah, I got the uh, wave, wave beam. Yeah, I think I got the wave beam. Supposed to be charge shotting. Let's charge and bam. Charge and bam. Die. Two charge shots. It's like right uh, somewhere. That does not help. I did not mean to do Okay. Right there. Okay. How the fuck do I get there? It's really hard to see. Like, the terrain. Enemies? No problem. Doors? Easy. Uh, the terrain? Not so much. What was that? What are you doing? What are you? What are those? Hold on. Scanning! Sentry drone. Well armed and armored security mecha. Security drones have limited intelligence, but do their assigned tasks well. Being machines, they are susceptible to electrical attacks. When alerted, drones initiate a security lockdown, then attempt to neutralize the intruder. Their electronic warfare suit can scramble visor technology as well. Oh, lovely. The doors have been unlocked. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Oh yeah, this is the down door. Like fucking Super Metroid. <laughs> Let's go. Let me in. Hello? Open the fucking door. There we go. Ow, bitch! Sorry. Ho! Oh yeah, there's Metroids in containers. A bam. My nose itches. Stop. Hold on. 
Who? Where? Where are you? Comet music. I don't see enemy. It's that meme with the, the lady looking around with the Skyrim combat music. Is that him over there? Is he just on the ceiling? What are you doing, dude? I can see you. What? Oh, that hit him. Okay. Psh, aimbot works like a charm. What a stupid space pirate. Still combat music, still enemies. Oh, hi. I was just talking about you. Well, my life sucks. You keep dodging my attacks and I don't like it. Bitch! How dare you still live? All Metroids must die. Return peace to the galaxy. Incoming scan data. Hold on, your scan data can fucking wait. Alright. What is it? The service is found in quarantine zone. Oh, it sounds lovely, like Halo 2. Uh, that's where I was going. Cool. There's definitely not gonna be a boss there. There's some damn good pretzels, man. Alright. No, there's still someone in here. Up above, probably. Hello? Ah! That's a scary game! No one told me it was a scary game! And we're fine. Metric Prime is a horror game, question mark? Yeah, my main complaint about the game so far is just, it is way too clunky. It is way too jank. This, this does not work for me. It's, doesn't work for me it's too slow it's too clunky it's just I don't like it I wonder uh, I'm I want I have to wonder if they improved upon the camera controls in prime 2 because prime 3 is a uh, fucking weird mode nunchuck it doesn't have those problems but prime 2 is still on GameCube so I gotta wonder Get out of my face. Thank you. Like, it feels like I'm getting hit unnecessarily, like an unnecessary amount, simply because the camera controls are kind of bad. Like, I'm getting hit constantly. Which might be one of the reasons why they just threw E-Tanks at me. And why aiming is so easy. You just aim in a direction and shoot. And it will just kind of hit them. Like, this is aim assist in the game. It also gives you useless uh, ammo pickups when you don't need ammo and it gives you useless energy pickups when you don't need energy. Like I think all those guys 
mostly dropped missiles, and I'm full on missiles. I don't need any. Speaking of which, I have not gotten any missile upgrades. I have not seen any missile upgrades. Uh, behind, this way. Save station up ahead. Save stations heal, right? What? This is a. Uh... Okay, yeah, I'm outside. Thank God. I hate. <laughs> I hate trying to find my way around the thermal visor. It's just. Uh, it doesn't work. Over here. Kill me! Whoa, excuse me. Yeah. I got like four E tanks. Or was that four extra E tanks? I can never tell. And only 25 missiles. So, yeah. Uh, oh, wait. Hold on. That was the issue, wasn't it? I couldn't get through here. I have no idea what I'm doing. Up here? Mm -mm. <clears throat> Thermal visor. I don't get it. Do I just nuke the bastard? Try that. No, I do not nuke the bastard. Uh, did I get any recent power ups that may help? Wave beam boostable. Thermal visor. Yeah. What's this? Oh, really? Okay. I didn't know that. Didn't I get... Didn't I get super missiles at some point? I don't remember. Did I? I did, didn't I? Did I? How do I super missile? Doesn't tell me. Uh... Damn it. Thank you. 
The super missile is the power charge combo. Okay, 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 okay. Bam. No. Bam. Bam! Bitch. Wait, hold on. Oh! What? Interesting. Let's shoot it again. Fuck. Okay, uh... Ah! Aha! I'm a fucking genius. Now I'm almost out of missiles. Damn, I'm a fucking idiot. Who dares? Who dares? You dare? Whatever, they're not- ah, I want that. Thank you. Almost full missiles. Oh, that's my, uh, that's probably what I'm hearing. Nice explosion, dude. I'm really feeling it. Mighty suspicious, don't you think? I sure hope nothing attacks me in this massive room. Spider ball. Probably. I see that back there. I'm probably gonna get spider ball. A rock? A big rock! Multiple big rocks! A rock monster? It wasn't a rock. It was a rock monster! Hold on, I gotta scan you. This isn't the scan visor, hold on. Bitch! You are a little shit, you know that? Thardus, an animated sentient creature of stone charged with phase-on radiation. The phase-on radiation given off by Thardus negates auto-targeting systems. Preventing lock on. It may be possible to acquire alternate targets with a different visor. The chaotic nature of Bazon irradiation leads to instability in its structural integrity. Thardis can encase targets in ice, and its colossal size and strength make it a formidable opponent.
Is there a reason I'm not moving? Oh, I was uh, being stupid and holding R, that's why. Oh, come on! Ah! Kaboom, baby! Hail to the king, baby. Oh, he's still big! Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Okay. Avoided it. Ow! Never mind. Ah! You're more aimbot than I am, dude. Stop. Save night, Gail. I don't know if I'm supposed to be able to dodge him or I'm just supposed to take it. Cool. I was able to dodge him that time.
Oh, he's gonna do his little lightning storm thing. Yep. Hey! Straighten the ball! Come on! Don't be a punk. Dude, what the fuck? Why does he keep rolling into a ball? I'm not trying to lock onto your fucking balls. I'm trying to lock onto you. There, it's dead. Honestly, that was the lamest boss fight I've ever had the, you know, displeasure of fighting. <laughs> like, if I'm being completely honest, that has got to be the most boring boss I've ever fought in a Metroid game. You just... You just, you aim at it, you shoot at it, going like this. And it aims at you and shoots at you while going like this. And then you shoot it, it goes, ah. And you swap visors and you shoot it and it goes, ah. And then it rolls into a ball and it rolls at you and you go, ah. And then it comes out of ball, you shoot it and it goes, ah. And then you shoot it again and it goes, ah. And then it keeps doing that. It's kind of lame, if you ask me. Uh, my issue with it probably was... Uh, it felt like they treated it as a main boss. That should have been a sub-boss. Like a side, like extra boss. Like... They should have, that should have been a side boss. And they should have reduced the amount of times you had to shoot it. Like, by a lot. Like... I can get, you know, doing that whole thing where you shoot, swap visors, shoot it again, like three times. But what, I had to do it like six times? Uh, maybe more, actually. I had to do both legs, I had to do both arms, I had to do the body, and I had to do like two things on the back. Like seven times I had to do that, where you shoot it. Swap visors, shoot it again. I had to do that seven times. That's boring. They should have drastically reduced the amount of times you had to do that. Yeah, spider ball. Here we go. This one's R1 morph balls you attach to spider ball tracks. Alright. It looks so weird. I look like Wheel Kirby. All right, what's that? <sighs> A little bit to the right. Hold on.
There's definitely something up there. Maybe. I don't fucking know. I have yet to find any actual secrets in this game, which makes me wonder if there are secrets. Excuse me? What? Okay, this has got to be it. Um... Well, that's where I'm supposed to go, like... Yeah, it's over there. I want to know it's over there. Can I get over there? I don't even know if there's anything over there. Like, it looks like there's something over there, but I really can't tell, and I can't get up there, so... You know. Go over here, drop down, add a ball. More rolly time. The right way, right? Yeah, yeah. Are they gonna be more. Yeah, it's gonna be more zappy, guys. Ow. You just gotta go. Don't be a pussy and just fucking do it. <laughs> Uh, what do we have here? Many more caverns! Dick. I immediately hate everything. There we go. Thank you. I thought fight. Did I just vibrate my? Oh, my phone started buzzing. At the same time, the fire shot. So I was like, wait, is that vibrating my desk? Alright, what's this then? I didn't know there was a floor below, so... Oh, there is lava. Sometimes. Yeah. 
All right. Where the fuck am I? Oh, there's little ball buggers beneath me. North Channel door sealed. Oh, no shit. Really? I didn't know. How do I unseal it? There's an E-tank in there. I've gotten more E-tanks than I've gotten missile tanks. Which is zero, by the way. Seal. Do I open it from below? East sealed. There's a light though. Where's the uh what's that? This machine is functional, but it is currently not receiving power. Three nearby power conduits must be energized for it to open. Blast of electrical energy will energize the conduits. The conduits radiate some heat that is invisible in the normal spectrum. Okay. Where's the uh, southern channel thing? Is it up here? It is not up here. Or is it? No, it's not. It's over there, actually. Uh, that leads out of here. All right. Let's find that bad boy. What the fuck? Bam, 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 bam. Bam. Did I do it? Sealed. I think it's activated. I'm going on a limb and saying it's activated. Oh, bam. Okay, I just need to shoot. I don't even need to charge. I can just bam. I should go over here. And bam! Open the door! Yeah! It seems you have some good, like, vibing music. So far, I've yet to be impressed by the combat music, but the uh, just the regular music that plays, very good to just jam, to just, just vibe with. I fucking hate these things so much. They're actual fucking. What the? You, you, are you kidding me? Literally used a fucking force to pull me in. Ass. Okay, that leads to my demise. This is where it's at. Uh, what the fuck? This is the East Channel door. Granted, lava within China has been cooled. I don't know what I'm getting. What?
North Channel Door. I gotta hurry, I guess. Mine's been Donkey Kong 64. It's like bonus stage. Look at that, another E-Tank. Even though I have not gotten a single missile tank. Awesome. I haven't really, uh, since I started and was in Magmore Cavern, constantly just taking damage from lava and getting hit by shit. I have not died other than that, I don't think. Especially with the amount of E-Tanks I have. Like... I don't know. I just like all right workstation tunnel uh are you different no you're not you're just a zoomer <laughs> zoomer scan the debris no damn all right can I blow up the debris no, I cannot. Okay. Why not? Wait. Worth a shot. Why did that happen? How could this happen to me? I've made my mistakes. <laughs> you know what I would really love right now? A missile tank. Please give me... Puddle Spore. Sentient floating lava mollusk protected by an impenetrable shell. A puddle spore opens when approached, attempting to intimidate with its size. When open, direct fire to its mantle causes it to flip into a defensive position. If it can slam shut, it ejects a spread of harmful energy globules. I see. I see. Ow. What, you little bastard! Who is making noise? Where's the racket? Why is that racket? Caverns. Am I missing? Or I can't. I should not hit that. Something on that wall. What do I do here? Is all this just for show? It's like, you don't do anything, and it's just a waste of your time to just look at it? What's the point of coming up here? If I had a better jump, or I'm assuming that's like a grappling thing, maybe. Yeah, alright. 
shut up. Awesome. What do you want? Rotating lift platforms, huh? So that's the story here, huh? Rotating lift platforms. Is there any way to activate them? Or am I still wasting my time? Uh, yep, grapple beam. I have a feeling. What's under me? Oh, hello. I still hate you. Die. What's the good word? Whoop. Worth it. Maybe. What am I aimed at? <laughs> Puffer. Unstable gas filled organism. I swear I've scanned these. Maybe uh, I forgot to rescan him uh, after uh, a save load or something. So, like. Fuck me, I guess. Oh, this leads back to. Hmm. This leads back to the uh, rest of Magmore Caverns. It's whatever. Who is not shutting the fuck up? Definitely not supposed to come this way until I have grapple, but I don't fucking care. And I'm not going the long way around. It's just annoying. Hi ya. Ta da. Ow. Where am I? Oh, I'm in this room. What's this? Oh. Oh. 
That's right, there was a spider ball thing here. No! Stop! Yeah, the controls swapped on me. Hell yeah. Hell yeah! Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Town Overworld, uh... Do I want to go Town Overworld? Or do I just want to go straight to the ruins? Yeah, uh, wait. Yeah, it's gonna take too long to go through Magmore. I'll just go through whatever the fuck this place is called again. Talon. They're really good. Can I get to the top of this room? I mean, this is some just good jamming music. Just vibe to. Like, damn. Landing site for a refill or straight to Chozo Ruins? Uh, I feel like I'm. Uh, let's show. Uh, hmm. Shut your mouth. Wait, who? Where? What? Where's the water room? This here, I think. Uh... There's things I can go, but I don't think I can go in there yet. I'm willing to bet I can't.
Don't talk to me. Just making sure it's the right way. Let's go! Can I go there? Maybe, perhaps. I feel like it's been a while since I've been here. Not here, next room. I didn't scan this. <clears throat> At the highest point of our city lies the fountain. The fountain. A wellspring of pure water that flows throughout our civilization. It is the jewel of the Chozo, the life giver. And yet its waters speak of a clouded future. As we come to understand the paths of time and space more clearly, we have begun to glimpse through tatters of past and future, glittering behind reality like soft lights behind a curtain. We have seen the fountain in these glimpses, pouring darkness instead of water, and we cannot guess what the visions mean. I, uh, I can barely hear myself because of headphones, but I feel like... My Optimus Prime impression was fucking awful. There's a lot of enemies you just gotta shoot behind in this game. Oh my god, just die. Stop it! Go away! Ow. They actually attacked me. I, I thought they were just cowards. All of them. Give me your stuff! You took everything from me. Oh my god. Where are you coming from? Where are you? Bastard. Something over there. I'm gonna check it out. Or not! <laughs> Fuck you, space jump. What is this? What is this? Are you trying to make me use boost ball? There's no point. I could just go around.
This tree says, seems to be weakened due to cellular decomposition. Ayo. What? Gonna bomb it somehow, right? Damn it. Let me try again. Maybe from this side. Bitch! I just drop like immediately. Let me try once more. Come on. No. All right, what's the fucking trick? What am I supposed to do? I was like, oh, it will automatically stick me in the hole because that's what it usually does. But uh, uh, I'm not sure if that's what it does. I'm not sure if that's what I'm supposed to do. Because I was able to just stand on it. And now I can't. Okay. Awesome. Uh, totally makes sense. Yeah. Uh, what the fuck am I doing? Stop. Stop. Holy shit. Oh my fucking god. Ugh. Such ass. What the fuck? What? I... Uh, 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 yeah, I don't get it. Uh, no, nah, uh, what? I really don't get it. What the f Whatever, I'll come back later. I guess I l just can't do anything with it. Where am I going? Uh, I can go this way, I think. I forget, they're annoying. Alright, through the chute we go. Right? Maybe? It's way up there. Probably can't. Ooh. Bum, 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 bum. Is that a fucking... Oh my god, I finally got a missile expansion. 
Holy shit, dude. Uh, this isn't... Ironically, this is not what I was looking for. I thought there would be a, uh... uh spider ball track in here. Oh my gosh, shut your mouth. Shut your mouth. One charge shot. All right. Wow, that was pointless. I see. I see. Ah! It's actually making me use the boost ball. Hiya! Woo! Yeah! Bitch! Reverse the controls on me. Again. What's up here? Uh, stop. Oh my god. Holy shit. Another missile expansion! Yeah! I'm finally getting missiles? For coming back to the ruins? All the missiles are in the ruins, I guess? Tower of Light. Okay. All right. Bitch. The dick's in a twist. Somebody help. Something behind me. Oh. Come back later, gotcha. Come back when you have gravity suit, bitch. All right, let me try uh, climbing this again. Hello. I have made it to the top of the tower. Now what? Right. Bitch. Try again. Uh. <laughs> Damn it! <sighs> oh, bah, ah! Come on! Aha! No! 
Ah, there's nothing in there. Okay. Whatever. I'm leaving. Moving on up. Moving on up. Don't you dare. Ah, he dared. Oh, well. He can't climb over... Get in the door. He can't climb over that wall, so uh, I don't care. Look at that. We're sitting at a night... Mm. Mm. Ugh. Wait, what's that? What? what? Oh, wait, wait, hold on a second. How do I get that? I want that. Give me that. How do I get that? Hey, hey, hey. Oh, oh. Oh, ho, ho. Wait, wait, fuck. Well. Wait. Oh, oh, okay, okay, okay. Okay, I know, I know. You guys deal with butt man. Butt man. No. Eh. Where is it? Right here. Yeah. More missiles. We went from no missile upgrades to multiple missile upgrades all in the same day. That's nice. I like that. It's very, very good. Very. Very, very clean, yeah. All right, where am I going? <laughs> uh, wow, way over there, huh? <laughs> All right, uh, what's that? Oh, that's where I was just at, okay. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Oh yeah, I was trying to figure out how to. Yeah, I could get. Oh, okay, I could get there from there, actually. So let's get there. Don't touch me. Oh, these guys are such bastards. I hate them. Don't touch me. I just gotta. Did I scan this? Did I scan this? I did not. <clears throat> As we struggle with the great poison, something stirs at the edges of our vision. It is the hatching, hatchling Samus. We feel her. That's a crime. <laughs> Across the void. Oh, that's better. <laughs> As she hunts the corrupted, will our fates again be won? As our pride shatters, will prophecy become real? When all the strength wanes from the Chozo, will it be the hatchling who fulfills our legacy? True sight eludes us, for the poison gnaws at all vision. Leaving seers blind and filled with despair, truth's blessing may come too late. Here I am. Free you from your despair or whatever you were saying. Is there a reason I didn't go through this? Oh! Oh! Yeah, that's right. Okay. Grappling. Okay. Hi, yeah. Ow. Oh. <laughs> Stupid.
Oh, this room. I know this room. Wow, that is really far away. Aw, oh, that would have been sick. No, okay. I'll see if I could, uh, go through there. I need that save room. Where's that save room? Is it a- yeah. Gimme! That looks like a miss, but okay. Aim assist. Sure, I'll take missile refill. Um. Yeah, I see it. I see it. Oh, okay. Bump over here. R. And then shoot. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Have I been up there? Yeah, it goes over there. All right, I could just do this. Hey, <laughs> what? Go away. Stop. Don't. Don't. Shoe fly. Don't bother me. You're a pox. Did I scan those? What are you? Get out of here. No one likes you. A new creature. <laughs> To be continued. <laughs> Shriek bat. Territorial ceiling dweller. Body temperature peaks at 121 centigrade. Shriek bats have high internal temperatures, making them easy to spot with thermal imaging. They roost on cave ceilings while hunting for small prey. Fiercely territorial, they dive on anything that wanders near. Oh, really? Ah! Choke on a pretzel. <laughs> what? Oh, you bastard. I didn't know those were in the game. I didn't know those were in the game. Come on. No! Aha! Loser! Ah! No, we're fine. We're fine. We're solid. Oh.
Um. I guess I'm a bit confused. Uh, have I been here before? Like, I came through there. But have I been here before? A different direction? Uh, I was in there, I think. Was I? I don't know. Huh. We're gonna be open with that weapon. Um. I don't know what white door means. Can I just not hit you, or are you just immune to that? Alright. How do I get up there? How do I get in that action? Because this dying land pulled us from our dreaming state, and now we chose to walk as ghosts while the great poison sinks into the trees and waters, devouring all life. Some creatures survive, but their forms grow as twisted and evil as the force that fell from the sky. The heart of the planet will succumb soon, and so will we, even in our ghostly states. Already many chosen have faded and passed into the unknown. The great poison is unlike anything we have glimpsed in this or any dimension. It eats relentlessly, forming out life wherever it blooms and corrupting what it cannot kill. It will be our undoing. Our last hope lies in the cradle. The temple we hope might contain this abomination. It is almost complete, hovering over the impact site, the dark heart of the spreading evil. If we can finish before the last of our kind drifts into madness or death, there is a chance for this world. If we fail, we are doomed with it. Then I will die with them! No? Okay. Uh, back up here. No? Uh, where? How do I get up there? I must know. Must I? I want up there. Makes me think there's something up there. It probably is. Something. Somewhere. Through that door? Hmm, maybe. Ah! Whatever. Sudden music change. <laughs> I'll use that stupid ball <laughs> boost. <laughs> Yeah, boost ball! God damn it. Abnormally low temperature at ruin side. Where I was already heading? Crazy! The hatchling walks among us. Are these dreams, memories, foretellings? Is this the real life or is this just fantasy? Time and reality swirl together like estuary waters and we Chozo know not what to believe. She appears as ghost-like as the Chozo, but at times the mist clear. We see her wounded eyes and remember the child we found so long ago. 
What has she become, this newborn? Clad in Chozo armor, wielding weapons our hands once held. Does she dream of the Chozo as we once were? Does she long for her parents, lost to the same creatures that even now defile our sacred home? Does she shit? I thought it said shit, that's why I said it. Does she still live? A second plague has come upon the land, dousing the last flickering hopes of our race. Drawn by the very force we chose a hope to contain, a host of marauding creatures descended from space and invaded our temple, the Cradle. They tried in vain to destroy it, but its power remains beyond them for now. They possess some of the twelve artifacts we call the Cypher, yet do not comprehend their function. Ignorant creatures they are, blinded by the illusions of harnessing the great poison for their own designs. Stupid dumbass. Why would they think that? They walk about as masters of the planet, assimilating the ruins of our sanctuary into their experiments. We can but watch and wait for our doom. Speaking of doom, I love that game. I played it all the time when it came out because I'm Chozo and I'm ancient. Older than doom. You know it's ancient when it's older than Doom, back in 1991. But I love playing Doom, and I played Doom 2 as well, and oh, we're running out of space for the wall script. This Cordite statue is worn and weathered. Scan indicates the presence of power conduit behind the statue. Wow. What am I doing? I'm not <laughs> Uh White door. <laughs> the prophecies tell of the coming of the worm. Born from parasites nurtured in a poisoned womb. The worm grows devouring from within until the world begins to rot. The words of the seers have come to pass. For there, in the depths of the world, the ravenous worm lurks and feeds. From the stars it came, blighting Talon with its great poison. We can but watch as the worm grows. Watch and wait. Watch a movie. Watch a book. I don't care. I can't complain anymore. But the prophecies also speak of a great defender. The one who delivers the world from evil. The final days draw near. Is the newborn the defender of which the seer spoke? And we shall do all that we can to aid her, for she bears a legacy as she bears the ancient armor and weapons of our people. I'm not cleaning up her duty though, that shit stank. Chose the script channel, oh, okay. Worn and weathered. Oh, I think I just. Exploded it last time, right? Nice. Okay. Bip, 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 bip. Most interesting. Ah! Why? 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 Why is it? Oh my god. Why? Why does it slip so easily? Oh shit. Ugh. Uh... Yeah, okay. Hello? Anyone in here? Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Racing collector designed to absorb and store solar energy. They appear largely decorative. What about you? Uh, I'm sorry. Is this a...
identified as statue of a Chozo elder. According to Chozo lore, these statues serve as the watchful guardians of tombs and shrines. In outstretched hands are empty as if awaiting an offering. I'll be your offering. Ah, shit. Dicks. Aw, oh, dude. Man. Aw, oh, crap. Here, take me! Hold on, who's attacking me? Stop it. Who the... Thermal vision! Hold on, I need to scan you. Chozo Ghost, spectral entity, bioelectric field, and vulnerable to natural energies. As these entities face in and out of existence, the only way to track them accurately is with X-ray scanning. This partially phased nature makes them invulnerable to natural energy types such as fire, ice, and electricity. Their aggressive and erratic behavior is most likely due to the corrupting effects of Phazon on the Talon 4 environment. They appear to be drawn to Chozo religious sites, where they wreak havoc upon anything that dares enter the area. Okay. So it said it was immune to this, right? You know how impossibly difficult it is to find this fucking thing? The audio is like misdirecting me. I hear it in my right ear, but it's it doesn't work like that. It's GameCube. It doesn't have surround sound. Where the fuck? This is hurting you. I can't tell. Yes? Maybe? No? And I get stunned when I get hit, which I can't hit them back. Okay, yes. That hurt. It's dead now, right? Fucking hell, dude. It like it's way harder than it should have been because I didn't know what I was supposed to do and I couldn't track it. Oh, get, get let me up, up. There we go. Up. How was I supposed to know that was going to happen, huh? I didn't know he was going to play bowling with me. I thought he was going to give me a power-up. I thought I was playing Metroid. Not fucking Wii Sports Bowling. Nice on. I'm going for a strike. Hey, ya! Uh... Strike! 
Why do you say it like that? It's not like baseball or something. Bum. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, what does that mean? I'll read your fucking text. Don't test me. More and more, our tormented minds turn to the newborn. As the world continues to shift into brutal, disconnected images, she remains inarguably real, a fearless figure delving deeper into this blighted world, unmindful of the terrors that await her. Was she this way before, when we chose who found her, a fledgling orphan on a savage planet? Did a warrior's pulse already beat in her veins, filling her with righteous fury? Our hopes lie with her. We leave these messages for her, that she may find her artifacts and deliver the world from its evil. Hi Samus, how's it going? Are you doing good? How's life been? I hope you haven't been killed by the great poison. Wraiths we may be. But our reach is still long indeed. We shall fight the invaders and the poison they would master until the end. I'm good, thanks. I really wish it would stop bouncing me off. I was able to stand on this earlier. Hold on. Eh. Well, fuck me, I guess. Whatever white is, I'm supposed to hit it with that and hit the red with missile. What the fuck opens white doors? I need to go back to the uh, actual objective, which is there. The door, apparently, right... Somewhere over there. <clears throat> Save it chill online. Windows secure. Okay. Is that the door? Alright, well, uh, I guess I'm just... Going back. Hold on a sec. What's in here? Was this a map room? Is this a map room? Was this a map room? It is. No, it's a missile recharge. I don't even know it's really in this game. Hmm. Pretty out of the way missile recharge station, but whatever. Right, right. I did a thing and it, uh, opened the ball track. Right?
Where did it? No way, did it fucking reset? Oh, that's bullshit. That's bullshit. Hold on. A million dollar question, how the fuck do I get up there? Oh, you've got to be shitting me. Interesting. When you hold R for a spider magnet, it just doesn't let you get higher with the this. Bitch, I had it. God, I, I don't like it. Stop it. Oh, you. There we go. What? There we go. Aw, oh, ass. If I wanted to play Disney Skate Adventure, I would just go play that. <sighs> All right. Nope. Mm, there we go. Blip, 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 blip. Give me the good shit. Oh, god damn it. Oh, was this it? Okay. Uh. Hello, I'll take uh, number seven with fries. Okay. Missile expansion. Was all this for missile capacity? All this is for missile capacity. <sighs> balls, balls, testicles, balls, genitals. How do I open this fucking door? <clears throat> Game help. Tell me what to do. Can I can I open it with the uh, the beam combo? I have no fucking clue what opens this. Is 
Is it perhaps super missiles? No, it is not. Fuck. And I am now lost and don't know what to do. Yep. Yeah, I, uh, I have no idea how to open the white doors. This is a lot of compressive and energy signal that appears to be affected by cold. Affected by heat. So I'm apparently missing an ice beam and a heat beam. What? Did I somehow sequence break, or is this game fucking with me? Because I need Ice Beam, and there's a door, and uh, I don't know how to get there. I'm guessing I need Ice Beam, but I don't know how to get Ice Beam. I have never seen anything involving getting Ice Beam. Throw me again, Pa. I can't believe the only purpose of that is to throw a ball. Chozo are so strange. I guess I'll just go back the way I came and try to figure out where the fuck an ice beam is.
Like, am I supposed to have Ice Beam at this point? Because I have literally not seen any indication of getting Ice Beam. Let's go. Yeah, it did go inside of the thing. Beam, huh? Don't touch me. Don't, don't touch me. My logic here is, oh, it's ice beam. It'll be in the heat room to, you know, cool off. That's usually how it is, or something. But... gotta do is uh you get pretzels stuck in your teeth you just use another pretzel stick to get it out <laughs> but uh actually what the what the fuck am I supposed to do I need to grapple for that. I'm looking it up. I don't feel like spending however long it's going to take for me to figure it out. I'm just gonna figure out what the fuck I'm missing. Climate 
anomaly detected. Antichamber. Metroid Prime. I think the thing is, I just somehow missed Ice Beam. This is not in any way annoying. Alright, let's see. to go there I think whatever
Ah. Can you please just die? Is there a reason why this just isn't fun? Like, these are the most, uh, this is the most unfar, unfun part about the entire game so far. Is these stupid fucking Chozo ghosts. Like, I'm sorry. You go through walls, you fly, you don't end up where you look like you end up. I can't fucking see you most of the time. I need to charge the normal fucking power beam in order to damage you. You stun me and I can't fire after like a few seconds. like three charge beam shots to kill. They fucking wait until I get near them and then they just run away. I 
I can't fucking see either. Where the fuck are you shooting me from? Fucking die, bastard. You're still not dead. Die, cunt, fuck. That was not fucking fun <laughs> at all. That was not challenging. That was not fun. That was not hard. I said challenging. That's the same thing. It was so unfun. I repeated the same thing twice. They better not force those enemies down my throat the whole fucking rest of the game. That just was not a positive experience in any regard. I feel like that wasn't even entertaining to watch. It's just like, hey, what should we do for an enemy? Oh, I know. Let's make a Chozo ghost. Oh, that sounds like a cool idea. Uh, what will they do? Uh, they teleport. The room gets almost pitch fucking black so you can't see them. Uh, we mentioned something about using x-ray vision to see them. But if you go to thermals, you'll see even less. And they only appear when you get a certain distance from them. They uh, stun lock you when you try to shoot them. Not stun long, but they stun you to where you can't shoot them. And then by the time you recover, they teleport. And they take too fucking long to kill. And just zip around this dark room. Constantly hitting you. Stunning you. Not letting you shoot them. Over and over again. Yeah, your idea fucking sucks, Jerry. tree area you shaped what the fuck do you want I'm aware I am fucking aware
is this? That which fouls the water seeks the sun. <clears throat> Blast cap. Uh, I feel like I already... Okay. Great poison comes from Talon's core. Okay. Yeah, I have no fucking idea what I'm doing. I'm gonna go here. What? Okay. Yeah, I just go uh, here. Can I? Can I? Yeah, thanks. Just go through here. Castrate myself and throw myself into a fiery pit. That's how I feel. Having to deal with whatever the fuck this is. Yeah, thanks. Let's get back to where we were. Go uh, up here. Go here. smaller room.
Can you fucking die? You incel. I fucking hate them. I really don't like fighting them. Supposedly, it's, uh, fucking here somewhere. I have to fuck with this half pipe. Where I need to fuck with this half pipe? I don't know. Was, uh... No? I mean, I just could like, zoom in or something. You know. Something most first-person games have. Zooming in. You know, it'd be nice if I could do that, but uh, I can't. So I have to just stick my head up to the fucking screen and look at this blurry ass image and be able to make out where I'm supposed to go. Map doesn't help. Okay. Yeah, it's way too blurry of a picture. I can't make it out. Maybe right there.
Am I even in the right fucking room? I don't know. Fucking... I... I don't know. Watching a YouTube video. Let me see. Watching a YouTube video on stream. Wow, that's crazy. It's like videoception or something. This is a fucking 10 minute video. I'm just gonna skim through it. That bowling man. Already, I'm annoyed. Yeah, I'm fucking annoyed. So apparently you have to go up here to these things, then you shoot it, and then you have to ball into it. I didn't know that. I didn't even know I could go up there. I thought I'd just kind of shoot it, and shit happens. And then he bowls me somewhere else. Yep. through here. Hi, how you doing? 
Grand Shutoff is holding, maintaining the water level of the reflecting pullet. 95%. Okay, but could you, like, not do that? Stone Toad. Probably not creature smaller than itself on the wall, only from within. Instead, it plus plus They're everywhere. Factions detected in Tolerant Alloy Drain Cover. It covers selections, but its integrity is unstable. Okay. There we go. And we got this half pipe, and we got these uh, chuckle fucks uh, who will try to eat me, I guess. Don't touch me. Well, he tried. And there it is. We can now progress through the game. Let me, let me just, uh, yeah! Oh. I have a question. What the fuck? Save room. Swift there. Long save room. an overworld east huh well uh i don't want to go there yet because i have ice beam now i can open the uh doors in the other place so i'm gonna do that
Town Overworld South. Okay. I don't want to go there either. I, once again, want to open the ice beam doors. By the way, I find it absolutely preposterous that there's doors that require the ice beam to open. Yeah, our door opens from ice. Who the fuck designed something like that? That has got to be the most half-brained idea ever. I'm gonna kill myself. Yeah, I'm not fighting those fucking assholes. They literally make me die inside. So let's just go there. Alright. And this leads back to this room. Okay, we have done nothing. I'm just gonna ignore them. My cat took a disgusting shake. Give me one moment. Hello, Samus. I see you've decided to go full screen. Crack open a cold one with the girl. Like, uh, sure. I got a squirt. Not a sponsor. Pretty nice soda, though. All right, what's going on? Oh yeah, I hate my fucking life. Can I use ice on you? Bitch. No. 
No, no, I cannot. I hate everyone. I hate everyone. I hate everyone. Hi, Samus. How's it going? Fucking kill me. There's three of them. Angrily sipping soda. <coughs> Is my life a joke to you, Metroid Prime? Bitch! I'll take that as a yes! Bowl me! You better get a goddamn turkey! What it is? What is that? E tank? Oh, look, another E tank. I've been really starving for those. I was starting to think I was never gonna survive anymore because of how fast I was dying. How quickly I was losing my energy, man. I really needed extra E-Tanks. That's what I needed. <laughs> it's gonna be as you half as many fucking E-Tanks as Fusion, it feels like. And Fusion has a reason to give you that many E-Tanks. Well, let me just extra. Let me just doubly make sure uh, this is not openable by missiles. No, it is not. There's some kind of heat beam. All right. Then I shall go find it. Where do I go again? Uh, that way. Yeah, 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 yeah. <clears throat> Where the fuck am I going? Ah, yes. Oh. I guess I'll go there first. Z 
zoom. Eyes and eyes. Send me up. Was there something behind that? I don't know. I don't care anymore. What is that? Seedling. Plant based ground feeder. You're a bottom feeder, and that's all you'll ever be. Dorsal spines can be ejected on self defense. Oh, yeah? Bam. Well, shit. I can make that. Why'd I come up here? What's up here? What's going on? What's going on? I stole that crazy frog! I guess there's nothing. Well, I can go up there. I'm gonna check down here. Hello? What? Metal bars? Impossible! Can't take this. Damn it. Woo! I made good use of the spider ball. I'd say that. That was weird. I'd say the, uh,. The spider ball benefits the most from this game out of all the power ups. Don't bastard. I changed my mind now. <laughs> Ooh. Wait a second. Wait a Motherfucking door over there. What's behind this door? What? What? Oh.
Just die! <laughs> Shatter enemies with the ice beam. You can freeze with the ice beam. Missiles. Interesting. Alright. Who's the jokester? Ah, we got a jokester here! Fuck. Sorry, it's a bad, bad line for a bad game. I don't need to tell you what it is. It's not my, uh... Not my wish to do so. What the fuck do I do about this? What? I don't understand. Gotta get over there! Hiya! Fuck. What seems to be the problem? Why isn't there anything in here? It's just a little cubby hole. A cubby hole of lies and deceit! What? Did I say to go that way? I'm so goddamn confused. What the fuck am I supposed to do? Where am I going? I don't... The controls are on the other side. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> Standard spinner device. Standard belt of spinner can be activated forever. Testicular cancer, Batman. What do we do? What the fuck do I do? Can I not do anything here? There's apparently a door up there somewhere. I think I see... Uh, Scan the tree. I must fuck the tree. Fuck the tree. Fuck the tree. Go. No. What do you want? I'm trying to do stupid puzzles. Unusual gravity, gravity pulses within Vendrana. Vendrana! I am sick of hearing Vendrana. Don't ever mention Vendrana. Don't you ever mention Ventrana in my presence again? Ah! Oh, gravity chamber. I wonder what I get from the gravity chamber. Fuck it. I'll leave this room. There's another door. Be gone. Oh my god. Ice beam is scary. Get me down. Or get me up. I get up! And nothing ever gets me down.
Let me out! Let me out! It's the save room. I don't need the save. It's behind the save room. My mistake. <clears throat> now, I would like to go through here. And go... Where the fuck I'm going? I don't... Uh... Talos Overworld. Yeah, that's the name. Talon Overworld. Not Talos. That's a guy from Elder Scrolls. Talos, the unassailable! What's the stitch? Not you, bitch. I hate you. Ow. Ow. It'll happen to you, too. Is missile? Is a missile. Demon grass. What the fuck? Hello. Hello, pigeon. Uh, uh, uh. Who the? Samus, quit having eyes and blinking. Why are frames dropping? Are right, you ready for this? It's gonna be mad. Oh. No, we're just losing all the frames right now. Why? Ooh. What the fuck? Ugh. Making noises makes it better, see? It's uh it's still not still bad. It's going up, it's going up. Alright, no, it's going down. Still going down. No, it's going up. It's going up, okay. No, it's going down. It's back up. It's going down. Man, I love internet. <laughs> I'm gonna do something mad sick. You'll never believe it. Oh my god, I'm so fucking good at video. I'm so good at video games. That's what we call, uh, God Gamer. Oh, thank you. Eh, 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 eh. There we go. Woo! <clears throat> Main ventilation shaft section C. I sure hope I'm not about to soft lock myself. Where am I? Where am I? Something strange is happening to me.
Now what's in here? I don't much appreciate that tone, son. I can't tell when they've had enough. Are you dead? Why is door not open? Door become open. You fucking asshole. This store has no power. Near right powder cone must be energized for it to open. A blast of a train. <sighs> yes, dear. Alright, uh. Open sesame. Where the hell am I going? Where is this leading me? Secret boss question mark? <laughs> is Crocomire down here? Hold on, what are these? It's a crab. Talon crab. Heart shot swarm life form. Once harvested for food. The exposure to Phazon has seen this practice diminish. Creatures are timid and harmless alone, but can be probably to have limbs swarms. Okay, I don't remember asking. I'm just gonna go. Freeze the water. Make a big ass popsicle. Reactor core. I like this soundtrack. Tangleweed, plant life with basic sentience, retracts into ground if threatened. Tangleweeds are only dangerous to small organisms. They are covered in tiny barbs designed to trap potential meals. Tangleweeds lack the strength to do anything more than hinder larger life forms. You're hindering me! Die! know why this is here what I'm supposed to do here if anything at all uh hi -ya. oh I see there's a little thing here
I need to sexually charge this door. No. Star has no power. Four nearby power cones will be energized for it to be open. Yes, they're uh, all over the place. Absolutely just crazy all over the place. Can I please drop down? Yeah, boo. That's two. Is that one? Three and uh, must be four. Blip, 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 blip. <laughs> I don't like this place. It's hard to see. Everything's slippery. But it's got absolutely surreal tunes. This has already got to be one of my favorite uh, tracks of the game. It's just really nice sounding. Power. What's through this door? A save station. Mmm. Save you must. Progression needs defeat. Monsters in the deep. Progress hindered by liquid environment. Energy tank lies within this crashed lift. A concussive blast should destroy the lift's door panel. Fish, please. Power suit augmentation required to advance. I can grab this and get another so very needed energy tank. So I'm supposed to come here later. Thanks for the E-Tank, I guess. I have to slowly backtrack. Get out of this reactor area.
I do mean slowly, because water makes us slower. And if I fall, well, that's just going to be even more of a time waste. What is that? Is it coming towards me? No, it's just sitting there. J-Zap. Gel-Zap? Gel-Zap. Aquatic predator made of electrically bound skeletal halves. The gel zap sprain is located in the upper half of its body, while the heart and digestive tract occupy the lower half. Linked only by electrical impulses, the two halves somehow function effectively enough to launch the gel zap to the top of Talon 4's aquatic food chain. Alright. Fuck you! You ain't nothing but a little bitch! I'm the top of the food chain now! You wanna try it again? A SPLAT! missiles. I've effectively doubled my missile capacity this stream. Very nice. I don't have to complain about not having any missiles. Goodbye. Great music. We'll still have some jamming tunes, but not like that. Amaz super amazing. Serenade of water. Be stuck. <clears throat> Almost slipped right back down to the bottom. I bet that's hell fun to grapple across. Oh well. Don't have grapple, so we just do this. Ooh.
I hope this game doesn't have an escape. Uh, I hope it doesn't have an escape ending, like Metroid usually does. I would not want to run around this whole fucking map like this on a time limit. All right, Vendrana drifts, huh? What's the best way to get to Vendrana drifts? to go through Magmore no matter what, so... Guess we're going to Magmore Caverns! Woohoo! Wait, I don't care. Not feeling it. Don't. Mag more caverns. Never find a more wretched place of scum and villainy. Shoot the fire! Straight up disconnected. Lovely. We're losing quite the frames. 
It's uh stinky. Lost connection again. Man, oh man. I love that this is a problem. Losing uh, all the frames. Should have disconnected from a stream, I think, just earlier. It might be disconnecting now or something. Yeah, there it is, disconnected just then. Fantastic. <clears throat> yep. And it reconnected. Is it actually reconnected though? No, it doesn't seem like it is. It's just going straight back down to zero. Fantastic. Well, I'm just going to get through this area because, uh, fuck this area. are gone. Replaced with jetpack dudes. Sorry, but uh, I'm not interested in what you're selling. Disconnected. I wasn't aware it was reconnected. Oddly enough. <clears throat> Reconnection successful. It's, uh... <clears throat> I'm not sure anyone live can even hear me or see what's going on, but for the, the VOD viewers, uh, internet's fucking shit. And that's just the uh, downside to having internet in California of the United States. It's uh, just fucking shit. It'll either be perfectly fine and work amazing, or it'll be shit and just not fucking work and turn off constantly. It's one of the reasons I literally could not stream in... November and December was the internet was just such ass and it is continuing to be complete shit right now and not getting better so uh yeah probably have to end stream early today because I would rather not stream a PowerPoint presentation if you catch my meaning. So let me roll this GameCube controller up and I apologize that my internet service provider is a bunch of dickheads who don't know what they're doing and insist on not giving the quality that we're supposed to get. So I'll hopefully see you tomorrow, unless my internet is completely dead 
as it just disconnected again. It's gonna show up fun on the, the Twitch channel. So, maybe I'll see you tomorrow. Maybe I won't. We're gonna keep playing Metroid Prime. We're gonna try and finish it at some point. Don't know how far I am in the game, but I feel like we're getting good progress, so I'll see you tomorrow, maybe.